Experts from all over the world have been sharing their vision on how to scale up the transition to circular economy. Entrepreneurs show courage, are responsible for investing and scaling up, but they cannot do it alone. One of the main conditions for change is regulations and incentives. What I see is our biggest partner is government. As soon as regulation is there, yep. you see dynamics. Well, government uh, needs to either look at incentives by lowering uh, taxes or input duties to improve uh, and increase recycled uh, content. Collaboration is essential. The circular economy means creating new relationships. I think the biggest piece that brought everything together was finding a partner in a retailer that would actually push this out on a bigger scale. Innovation and innovative perspectives are essential for system change as well. But how do we get there? It's the need to form a new value chain and the need to collaborate differently across that value chain. I mean, Create flexibility for new technologies. Smart experimenting and move ahead, even if you need to do a step back later on. Every stakeholder has its role to play but it takes leadership to get there. Because the consumer votes for the future they want with what they buy. But retailers need to act as the editor of the choices, edit out bad ones, and make more circular choices easy, convenient, and affordable to access. To convince the consumers to stop buying rubbish. Inclusiveness should not be overlooked. We must think of including this informal market and the, the, the most marginalized people in emerging markets. Doing it fair, doing it inclusive and doing it local. Skills are also very, very important. Trying to raise awareness on the circular economy in the academia world. Let's make climate impact by going circular and let's use this magic momentum that is present today. Mm -hmm.